Hey guys, I have not made a YouTube video in a while and this is the reason why I've been working on building an octocopter. I wanted something built more designed for aerial videography only and uh, this is the design I thought was best. It's versatile, I could always uh, change things up, mount a bigger camera on there all that stuff so that's why I went with the octocopter setup I'll just give you a quick run through of my design here of the build and uh, I'll show you some of the features as well in this video so first of all the frame is obviously an octocopter frame I bought the octocopter frame from quad frame USA it's an excellent frame carbon fiber Solid design, I really like it. Pretty easy to build as well. Uh, the flight controller, I went with the NASA, the DJI NASA, the V2 version. It's actually worked really well on this uh, setup so far. I love it. The speed controllers, as you can see, I went with the RC timer 40 amp Simon K flashed. They work really well so far. Motors here. I went with the Sunny Sky. I believe it's 380 kV heavy lift motor. RC timer carbon fiber props. 13 inch a piece with 4.0 uh, pitch. And it flies great. I've tested it out several times. I'll post more videos of the flight and uh, the aerial videography that's I've been recording on this as well. As you can see uh, down here, and let me uh, adjust this so you can see it, is the brushless gimbal setup that I have. The system that I'm using is the iPower uh, motors and frame and a uh, Martinez brushless control. All right, I'll show you a little bit closer. Take a look here. System. All right. On here, I have an FPV camera mounted at the bottom so I could see exactly what the video camera sees. FPV is right over here, if you can see it. All right. So, like I said before, this rig is designed for the next five. Uh, I could also mount a next seven, um, you know, next six, whatever, any of the next series, or the mirrorless class camera. Uh, video quality is pretty good, I like it so far. Let me just show you. Uh, you know the, the brushless gimbal system how it works and I'll go with some of the other features um, you know as you can see it's uh, pretty responsive works really well video quality I've been getting on it is good and I'll show you guys more of that later on all right, some additional features of the frame and the whole setup here. Uh, I set up the uh, Spectrum DX6i to control the gimbal. And with the gimbal set up, I could control pitch up, down, side, you know to kind of level off the horizon if I need to, um, or the gimbal operator needs to. Uh, my girlfriend is actually the gimbal operator. She's pretty good. She knows how to frame the shots pretty well. And then uh, I also have the pan set up here. Obviously the octocopter is turning itself because it's sitting on the table uh, but, you know, as you can see, if I just pick it up, um, 
I have full hand control of the gimbal. All right, this is it. The reason why I've been absent from YouTube for so long. But, you know, the build was really fun, well worth it. If you guys have any questions, feel free to post on the comment section below. I'll also put the uh, providers of where I bought some of this stuff. And have fun flying. Until next time, be safe.